this is Stampy, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video. Today I am playing a round of Hunger Games on a map called Medieval Christmas. And uh, this is a map that was built by Castle Crafters. Uh, over here you can see uh, a big board of people, and uh, yeah, these are all of the uh, the main builders uh, that had a, a helping hand building this map. And uh, as always with these, uh, there'll be a link in the description to their channel, uh, as well as a, a download to the link. And you may be sitting there wondering, Stampy, Stampy, have you gone crazy? It's not Christmas anymore. Christmas is over, Christmas is in the past, and I know, but you know what? I was such in the uh, the Christmas uh, festive spirit this year, I thought I'd drag it out a little bit and uh, carry on the, uh, the Christmas theme. And uh, this map looks absolutely awesome. And uh, yeah, I'm uh, good friends with the uh, the builders as well, so I thought I'd uh, definitely want to play it. And I got a bunch of friends in here that are going to be joining me. Uh, I got Elfa Lee, uh, Daisy, Ballistic Squid, Leomardo, uh, Venomous Spyro, Lewis Blogs Gaming, and uh, Venomous Crash are going to be my opponents uh, in this uh, game. So uh, I think everybody's ready. Squid seems to be about to get into his pod. Um, I need to get into the host pod, uh, which is the uh, the one over here. And uh, there seems to be. A few empty pods around the place. Is everyone is everyone in place? I can just see everyone there jumping up and down, poking their heads up. I think there's people in them, but they're just so sunk down I can't actually see them. But uh, if everyone's ready, uh, let's start the game. Good luck, Lee. Good luck. Right, we will start the Christmas Hunger Games in a three, two, one. Go, 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 go. Go, go. <laughs> what lever do I press? What button? What do I do? Has everyone else gone? Are they all going? No, they have not gone. Let's start this again. <laughs> Let me actually read the descriptions. Uh, button does pods. Lever PVE rules are behind this pod. Oh god, I should have read. I should have read the rules, really. Right, let me try and. Oh, everyone's up. Everyone's up. Everyone's in. Everyone is in. Everyone is in. Oh god. <laughs> World's worst start. Right, I got some cookies. That's managed uh, to cheer me up a little bit. And brilliant, some coal and a helmet. Right, forget it. Forget all this stuff. There doesn't seem to be much good in there. Uh, I managed to get a helmet. Uh, we have a one-minute grace period, uh, which means, of course, one minute. Uh, we're allowed to run around without getting attacked by people, supposedly. And look, I've got some some more cookies, which is a, a pretty good start. I just want some sort of weapon. Uh, gold might help me maybe in building a sword, but I just want to get, even if it's a wooden sword, I just want something that's going to be able to, to help me defend myself. I'm going to put my leather cap on, so that's pretty much all I've got to my name. And yeah, let's just try and go around and try and find something a little bit better. And oh god, there's a zombie pigment. I think I pressed a button to make all of the mob spawn. You know, it says PVE. That's supposed to be player versus everyone. So I think because I, I pulled that lever or pressed a button, I've basically uh, added a whole load of uh, googlies into the map. So I didn't mean to do that, but oh well. Might make things a little bit more exciting. And look, there's a chest down here. More cookies! I'm certainly seeing the uh, the theme here. Like, they say it's Hunger Games, although there are... um. Uh, so there is a cake absolutely everywhere, uh, which is good for me because I love cake. So, um, yeah, I don't think there's going to be too much worries with uh, losing our hunger, but it's nice to have a, a few cookies. Cookies are a bit rubbish, though, to be honest, because they only, like, very slightly get your health up. And I did notice here, look, there seems to be a few ladders up on the uh, back of this elf here. And, oh, God, I'm getting attacked by everything. How do I How do I get up here? Do I reckon, I, do I reckon I've got to jump on the, the cake somehow? Hmm, okay, I'm not going to worry about it too long because I still don't have a sword yet, so I think that should definitely be my pr first priority. I'm going to try and keep my head on a swivel and keep looking around just to uh, make sure no one sneaks up on me. And it's actually probably quite good timing because it just became day uh, as I was starting the video, so uh, all of the mobs uh, should be burning because I really didn't mean to, to have that co them coming in as well. And uh, yeah, I don't actually know if I've got death messages on, so I don't know if anyone's died yet. And I want to be very careful because there is people absolutely everywhere and when gamer tags are off, it is mighty scary. Right, this door seem to have been shut uh, so I doubt someone's been in here unless they've, unless they've been uh, careful shutting doors behind them and I still have nothing I still have no swords or anything all I've got to defend myself is cookies and uh, there's a bunch of dogs there on the other side actually if I get some bones that could be quite good and there we go I have finally got myself a stone sword I haven't got much armor and a stone sword isn't the best but at least uh, if someone does come after me I, I am able to to fight back a little bit so I'm gonna stay in here and uh, have a few of my cookie uh, some of my cookies and I'm gonna uh, celebrate Christmas with a few of the animals Animals. And uh, yeah, then I'm gonna I'm gonna head off and uh, go and try and take some people out. I love all the the dogs there trying to dive through the window. I think they're feeling a, a little bit left out. Maybe it would be awesome if I got a bone. If I got like a bunch of bones for some skeletons and was able just to tame all of those dogs, that would be amazing. That would be like printing a victory. Oh, they're not even like. 
I thought they were in like a cage. They're just there, just jumping up and down, getting very excited about something. Anyway, there's a hidden chest around here. Another sword. Uh, I suppose I might as well take it just to, to stop someone else from getting it. And uh, what I might do is just... Oh, look, there's a, there's a little silverfish around there. Did you see that? Little little baby silverfish wandering around. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to circle around the outside of the map. Uh, that way I should hopefully be able to avoid people. And there seems to be uh, a few hidden chests around here. I managed to get uh, a little bit more armor there just to, to protect myself. So uh, if I guess I stay around the outside looking for hidden things. I can hear, I can hear, there's all silverfish all over the place. How have all the, um, the silverfish spawned in? And what are they in this texture pack? What was that? <laughs> that was kind of, kind of creepy looking. I think, I think there's like pressure pads or something that spawn them. I didn't know you could you could just spawn them in. I guess you can get spawn eggs. Uh, something else about this map, actually, I didn't mention is that apparently there's a, a few Easter eggs and uh, oh god, I heard a chest. There's a chest. Wait, forget that. I'll tell you about that later. There's someone in here, I believe. Let me try and surprise them. They don't know I'm here. I can't get in. Right, if I go around here, quiet, quiet. Don't tell them. Don't tell. Where are they? I heard a chest opened a second ago. Have they disappeared? Where have they gone to? Let me look in this. Is this chest empty? They were here a second ago. They must have gone out this way somewhere. Hello, oh, they're right here. They're right here. Oh no, go get them. 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 Oh no, 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 no. Go, go, go. I can't run. I'm getting quite hungry. Right, go, 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 go. I think I got a few good hits on them. See if I can chase them into all the spiders. Oh, look, there's a skeleton going after them as well. Go, 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 go. Oh, what's he splashed me with? He tried to get. I think he missed me then. There we go. I managed to take someone out. I managed to get all of this loot as well. Right, just grab the stuff. Oh, look, there's a, there's a bow down there. I got a few potions. Oh, a cake. <laughs> Love, lovely. And uh, yeah, I've got all the stuff. Okay, that was good. I've got one kill on the board. And now I can back off and hide somewhere for a bit. And I can try and put on all my extra armor. And I'm gonna eat a little cake just to just to celebrate me getting my first kill on the board. I don't like these silverfish though. Oh, look, that one's there coming after me. Let me get a look at it and to try and see what it what it is actually supposed to be. What is that thing? Oh, it's like a little a little caterpillar or something, isn't it? <laughs> right, there we go. I managed to take out the silverfish. Let's try and sort some stuff out. Did I get any more armor? I got a chainmail helmet. Is that someone up there actually? I oh, know, that's just a, just a spider. I got a potion of a healing, uh, but I got a bow as well, which is probably uh, the best thing I got out of that. And a cake. Uh, so I'm just going to go and uh, have the cake quickly here now, because I'm actually getting pretty hungry. So num, 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 num. Right, anyway, what, one of the things I was saying about this map is... um. Uh, there's actually a bunch of uh, hidden things uh, to do with YouTubers, and uh, apparently there's going to be uh, a few things uh, referring to me here, so I would definitely uh, want to try and hunt out some of that stuff. But I've got to avoid all the mobs, though. They're all over the place around here. Uh, like, I've, I always feel more confident once I've got one kill, because I feel like even if I lose now, I've done okay. And oh, look, there's someone over here! All right, let's go after him. <laughs> I think that's Leomardo. He immediately backed off the second he saw me. I'm going to charge him down. What sword is that? Is that is that stone or is it iron? I'm not sure. Oh, God, he got a few good hits on me. There we go. I managed to, I managed to take him out. And we had a few potions. I think that was a um, I think that was a poison potion there. They are awesome in Hunger Games. Right, okay, once again, let's just go and hide for a little bit and try and stay safe. And then I can go and try and sort out if I got anything new. Did I get any... No, I didn't get any uh, good armor. I didn't get a tunic or anything. But uh, there we go. I managed to get uh, a splash potion of poison, which will help me out. And here, a splash potion of healing. Uh, only stone swords. Uh, yeah, and I'll get some apples and put them there. There we go. So uh, I feel like that helped me a little bit. I've already managed to take out two people. I'm doing good. Right, let's go and try and uh, hunt down whatever there is referring to me then. This is the spawn here. Uh, so I guess I've only really been on this side of the map. Well, there's a big tower here. It might be quite nice just uh, to climb up here. Then we can go and uh, look over the, the entire map. Oh, there's a few chests up here. Oh, of course there been looted. Like, it's getting to- oh, look, there's a, there's a music dish. Should I put the music disc on? Should I have a little dance? <laughs> I think I play Hunger Games differently to how other people play them. There we go. We can have a little boogie. It might, like, pull people up here. People might hear the music and be lured to come up here, and then when they come up the stairs, I can just jump them and surprise them like this. <laughs> oh, dude, that'd be quite funny. I'm not actually sure how many people are left, and I'm a little bit hurt, so I might actually camp here for a little bit just to get my health up. Uh, so who's left? We've got Daisy left, Crash left, and Lewis Vlogs Gaming. There's only three people left. So whatever, uh, I'm in the uh, the top four, but uh, being in the uh, the top one would be uh, even better than that. Right, is anyone out here? God, you can just see the, the googlies all over the place over there. All of the, the zombie pigmen and all sorts. Zombie pigmen should be okay, because uh, they only attack you once you attack them. Uh, otherwise, they're they're relatively docile. And there's a chest up here. Oh, there we go. I uh, got a, a leather tunic. That should uh, be able to help me out a little bit. That's the, the one bit of armor I was missing. And uh, what direction was I heading in then? What looks interesting? Oh, look, see the Santa up over there? See Santa up in the sky? I think this is the side I've not been at. Um, so yeah, they see there's his big sleigh. What's shooting at me? Is that a skeleton or a person? I'm not entirely sure. And uh, what's this over here? We've got a few presents. Oh, here we go. To Stampy, the happy go jolly cat from Castle Crafters. Look, I got a cake. Uh, a cake, sorry, I got a present covered in cake here with the, the orange and white stripes on it. And look at that big bell tower in the distance. This is a really cool looking map, actually. And look, there's a, a huge castle over here as well. 
Should we go investigate over here? I think this is a, a likely place for someone to be camping. So I'm going to I want to be watching all of my corners as I go around here. And uh, there's no way all of these chests haven't been looted. Right, is anyone in here? Hello! 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 Is anyone in here? Anyone in here? Anyone in here? But if, like, my eating echo just like... <laughs> <laughs> As I like, I'm eating my apple, and this place looks awesome actually. Uh, a very nice medieval Christmas themed map this is, and there seems to be a few little booths down here, a few chests. Uh, as I said, there's no chance these aren't all going to be empty because uh, people have probably cleaned up all of this uh, area before me. Yep, a whole load of empty chests. To be fair, there's not there's not much more I need. I've got a bow and arrow. And uh, I got a decent sword. The only thing I think I'd I'd prefer would be to get like a better sword. Uh, maybe a, an iron or diamond sword would make me feel happier. Or maybe a, a slightly better uh, armor. But with these potions and uh, with the armor I've got and the uh, the sword I've got and a bow and arrow as well, uh, I am actually feeling okay. So I'm at the point in the Hunger Games where I think I've seen enough of the map. Um, I've got enough loot. All I want to do now is go on the hunt and try and take out some people. Like, this is when I become mean, Stampy. And look, I got some fish. Right, I don't care about the raw ones. I've always been more partial to some uh, cooked fish. So I'm gonna grab them. There's, surely there's got to be someone in here. What I want to do is try and find a really high area. Uh, shop elves quarters. Oh god, there's a <laughs> that actually scared me then. There's a Steve head there on a, on a, on a, on a pike. <laughs> that's rather terrifying. Right, I want to find like, the oh there's someone right here. I think that's uh, Lewis Bloggs Gaming. Oh he's scared, he's backing off, he's backing off. Right, let's try and poison him if I can. There we go. Now he's going to be getting poisoned. Now I just need to go in for the kill. If I back off I can use my bow and arrow because he's going to be getting hurt by my poison anyway and so I don't need to worry about it. Oh he jumped off! He just, he backed off and died. He just backed off the edge. <laughs> oh, what a depressing way to go. Let's get down there and let's go get this loot, shall we? <laughs> I intimidated him off the edge. I scared him off the edge of the castle. That was amazing. What? <laughs> I suppose it technically wasn't kill my kill, but uh, yeah, it was still pretty hilarious. And I thought Squid was out, but I just saw he rejoined the game. I guess maybe he'd uh, lagged out and uh, he isn't actually out. Uh, so that's uh, one more person for me to, to have to worry about. But oh, look at all this stuff down here. I don't think he had that good stuff. I had a little bit of milk and uh, some other stuff around here, but I am going to go and just hide somewhere just so I can uh, see what new stuff I've gathered and sort out my inventory. Uh, let's go all down here. Oh, this is kind of pretty. There's a nice little hidden fountain down here. Probably a good hiding place just to have a look, see if I can upgrade. I think gold might be an upgrade from leather. If it's not, I'm sorry. I know you always tell me off of doing this wrong. There we go. Iron is better than gold. I am almost certain of it. Uh, I don't really need them. I don't really need them. I got, I got like three map. I got a map from every person I've killed. It's like my, my trophy because I managed to take them out. And there's got to be a hidden chest down here. Oh, look, here we go. There's a, there's a, oh, God, oh, God, oh, dear, 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 no, get back, get back, get back, get back, get back, get back, please, no, 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 no. Oh, no. How did they find me down here? How did they find me in the little fountain? Oh, venomous scratch. If I was fighting on the surface and I could use my bow and arrow and my potions, I might have been okay. He completely snuck up on me. I never thought someone would find me in there. Okay, I guess the I guess the game continues then. What I'm not going to do, I'm not going to end it here. And um, there's only two people left. I think it's only Daisy and uh, Crash left. And uh, so what I am going to do is I'm going to uh, turn invisible and fly. And uh, because there's only two of them left, we're going to turn gamer tags back on. And uh, then that way we can watch the other uh, final battle and see who's going to win. And so let me just go turn gamer tags back on. And let me go and try and find them. And we can we can watch them from above and spectate. It's also quite a, a good opportunity to see the map from above, especially as you can see the sun going down there. There's the castle. That's the castle I was just in. And so I guess Venomous Crash is, yeah, he's still down here. He look at him there, look at him there stealing all of my loot, stealing all of my goodies, deciding what things he's going to pry from my cold, dead paws. <laughs> oh dear. Well, he managed to get a good kill on me. I think he, I actually think he had an iron sword, I think he had. Can I see? Yeah, I think he's got an iron sword. So I really had no chance. I probably like should have tried to maybe splash heal myself or something. But yeah, I'm, I'm not that quick at thinking. And so who else was left? Then Daisy as well. Where is Daisy then? Let's go and uh, try and track oh i guess she's left and uh, maybe she's uh, lagging in and out of the game right, let me just go and uh, uh, send a, a quick invite to daisy and see if i can uh, get her back in the game i think that uh, maybe squid was having a few lag issues as well and so it'd be good to, to maybe try and get him back in i send him an invite and uh, i go and send one there to daisy as well so uh, just in case they were lagging out uh, i did tell people to once you die to leave the game uh, then that way we're gonna know who's left uh, but if people are lagging out, then it's uh, not really fair. And so I guess Venomous Crash, all he needs to do is just sort of wait around for a bit. He's done all the hard work. He's just got to wait around for uh, one of his uh, opponents to, to rejoin. And oh no, it looks like he's lagged out as well. Hello everybody, and welcome back to another round of Hunger Games. I am playing on the medieval Christmas map that was built by Castle Crafters. Um, I have just played this map. 
Um, I don't know whether this is going to be part of the same video or the last video or whatever. Uh, but yeah, we did just play a round of this. And um, I thought everyone was lagging out, so I kind of just stopped recording. It turned out that uh, people hadn't, and uh, the last winner was Venomous Crash. And uh, I did actually okay in the last round. Um, there was a few funny moments of uh, mainly Lewis Boggs Gaming walking backwards off a castle because I scared him, which, uh, yeah, made me chuckle. <laughs> and so, yeah, I'm sure I'm going to be uploading that uh, in some way, uh, either as a, a link in the description or whatever. Uh, but, yeah, we're doing it again. Uh, so I have played this map before. I have a small amount of knowledge. Uh, but not very much knowledge, so uh, hopefully though, I'm going to do a little bit better this go and uh, hopefully end up managing to get the win. So is everyone in positions? I can see uh, Squid there just about to hop up into his pod. Nope, he's changed his mind. <laughs> he was trying to get in someone else's pod just because it was blue. He just looked in say like, is this, is this pod occupied? Can I go in? Right, there we go. He's finally getting in position. Everyone else seems to be in their Christmas presents. So we <laughs> can see there. Hi, Squid! Hi, Squid! Hello! Hello! <laughs> right, we will begin in three, two, one. Press the right button this time, hopefully. And we are up. Right, I want a better start than last time. Uh, last time it took me absolutely ages before I managed to get a sword. And oh god, I got the exact same stuff again. I just got a load of cookies out of the beginning. Well, a cake though. That's uh, better than the cookies. I mean, cookies are good. But to be honest, I was after something a bit more deadly rather than a bunch of cookies. It looks like I got like this whole side to myself. I got pretty much the exact same start as last time. Uh, and uh, a leather helmet and uh, a load of cookies. And uh, last time I ran off to the left. Oh, look, here's my present there. To the Stampy Cat. Uh, yeah, last time I ran off to the left. This time I know exactly where I'm going. I am going back to the castle because there seemed to be so much amazing loot in the castle. Uh, I definitely want to go and uh, make the most of it. Right, once again, we have a one minute grace period, which means there is a well, one minute uh, in which we are not allowed to hurt each other. Um, we can hurt each other's feelings. We can pull faces at each other and call each other's names, uh, but we're not allowed to uh, hurt them by hitting them or uh, so forth. And oh no, I guess these chests are empty. I remember, I, I unless someone's, someone's not been here already, have they? Oh no, there, there we go. I've managed to get a, a gold sword. At least I've got something to defend myself. I remember the last episode I came here and all the chests were empty and I was saying about how someone must have come and looted them all. Maybe they were just all empty anyway. Maybe there, there's just some chest that they decided not to, to fill in. Anyway, let's go and have a look around here. I've kind of went to the castle, uh, but I didn't have uh, time to explore it properly. And I love the look of it, to be honest. Uh, it certainly looks uh, good in this uh, natural texture pack as well. Uh, it seems to, to fit it really well. And there's got to be some chests up here. Oh, here we go. This has got to be like something really good up here. It's really right up at the top. Uh, it's okay. Uh, once again, a lot more cookies. There seems to be cookies absolutely everywhere. This is like for the elves. And look, we can go even higher. We can go right up to the, uh, the top of the, the tower up here. Right, I'm going to eat my cookies on the way up. I'm just going to make sure no one's sneaking up behind me. It's always good fighting on stairs uh, if you've got worse materials because uh, there's a good chance you can knock people off and uh, often the uh, the full damage will kill them rather than you actually hitting them. And is there a chest up here? There's got to be a chest hidden up here somewhere. Oh, well, here we go. Oh, I lead right up to the top up here. This would be an amazing place to go, like right at the end uh, because then you can look over the entire map and see where everyone is. Uh, at the moment, I don't want to stay up here because uh, I don't feel like I've got enough armor or anything yet. Anyway, what's over here? Uh, try crouch jumping. What do you mean by that? Cry crouch. I got a bunch of materials and I uh, got some bottles of enchanting. In case uh, I can enchant something a little bit later on, I might as well use them. I probably uh, won't enchant something, but uh, if I need to, uh, I guess I can. What do you mean try crouch jumping? Hmm. I'm not. Uh, maybe that's uh, like a personal joke to do with someone. I'm not entirely sure. I just want to check that there's uh, no more hidden chests around here. To be honest, I kind of hoped for something a little bit better than that in this chest up here. Nothing hidden around here. No, okay, well, let's go back down then. Is there a quick way down? Um, I can maybe go around the outside. There is water there. I don't know how deep it is. On a PC, whenever you fall in water, no matter what you survive, uh, on Xbox, uh, that's not always the case. So, um, yeah, I'm going to go a slightly more elegant route down. Not particularly elegant, but a little bit more than the other way. And uh, I'm going to go down the side here, uh, making sure that there's going to be no one sneaky enough on me. This is quite a little sneaky place to go, actually, around here. Like, climbing over all of the uh, the rooftops up the top. And here we go, I found another chest. Oh, it is empty, though, which means there was probably someone here. Unless, once again, it was just uh, another empty chest from the beginning. Right, I don't feel confident here. I don't feel like I've got enough stuff. Like, I've got okay armor, and i got a gold sword, so I'm not defenseless. Um, but yeah, I don't really fancy my chances against uh, anyone other than some googlies. And look at my sword as well. Look, my sword's like almost completely destroyed. I shouldn't have gone after that googly. I should have left the um, the zombie there. And oh no, I just threw a uh, threw a cake down there. Oh no, this is going so wrong. I did so much better last go. I'm still alive though. I'm still in it. There's no point panicking now. Like I've not even seen someone yet. And I'm already uh, like holding my head in my hand saying I've failed. Well, someone was taken out though. Uh, Venomous Spyro uh, was slain by Daisy. So uh, I guess Daisy's doing okay. What I might do do 
is uh, try and team up with someone and uh, see if they can help me out, seeing as I'm not doing uh, too grand by myself. I might, uh, if I see someone with better stuff than me, try and uh, team up with them. And, uh, oh, okay, there's an enchanting table there. I don't really want to enchant this golden sword, uh, just because it's going to be pretty much destroyed soon. Like, it's going to get destroyed, like, halfway through my next battle. I just want at least just, like, a, a stone sword or something, just to uh, help me out a, a little bit more. Uh, but I really need to try and get out of this castle without uh, anyone seeing me. I'm going to have to be sneaky stampy, stealthy stampy I'm going to have to be for the uh, foreseeable future. And, oh, look, there's a, a big old massive library in here. I really did not realise how big this castle is. And here we go. At least I got a, um, a wooden sword. Oh, I got an iron ingot and a swiftness potion as well, I think I got there. If I get one more iron ingot, because I've got some sticks as well, I'll be able to craft an iron sword and that would be amazing. Right, that's going to be my challenge then. I'm going to try, if I can, to find some iron. And I love, like, jumping around the, uh, the top up here. Let's go. Oh, I heard someone. I heard someone get hurt. Did you hear that? I'm sure I, like, I fell and I hurt myself and I swear I heard someone else fall. Right, let's be very careful. I'm pretty sure I heard someone around here somewhere. This is quite a nice little hidey hole here, actually. If I got a bow and arrow and I could just go bing, bing, bing and shoot people as they came in, that, that would be pretty cool. Right, I'm going to have to try and be as quiet as I can as I sneak around here. And uh, hopefully no one sees me. Oh, look. Oh, look down here. There we go. I got a stone sword. And look, two iron ingots as well. Right, no one's coming, are they? This is what happened last time. I was trying to sort out all my inventory and stuff. And as uh, someone snuck up on me, uh, that's how I got uh, took out last time. Right, I got some, some more armor as well. So all I need to do now uh, is find a crafting table and I'm pretty sure um, I walked past one on the way into this room. I think back here somewhere I saw a crafting table. Right, hopefully I don't see someone now. Right, there's no one around here. Go, 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 go. Right, I'm going to shut the doors just so no one comes in. I don't think there's any way to get in there. Right, here's a crafting table. Let's go make myself an iron sword if I can. And I have done it. There we go. I've got an iron sword. And I can enchant it as well. Where was the um, the enchanting table? Look down here. I can enchant my iron sword. Right, let's do this quick before someone sneaks up on me. Uh, anything will do. Oh, I can't even click on it. There we go. I managed to enchant the, the iron sword and threw it on the floor at the same time. Uh, what did I get? Uh, fire aspect and sharpness. It looks like Lewis Vlogs Gaming was taken up by Ballistic Squid. Uh, he's not been uh, doing very well in these uh, last few rounds of Hunger Games. Uh, but what a massive turnaround I've had. I was in a mode of like, oh no, I'm doing awful, I'm going to fail, to I'm actually not doing too shabby right now. Right, what I'm going to very quickly do is have a, a little look around this library uh, just to see if there are uh, any more chests hidden in here, maybe to get some, uh, some potions or some better armor. And then, yeah, if I can't find anything, I'm just going to head straight off and uh, try and take some people out. I've got a good sword now. What I might do is walk around with my gold sword out and then that way people will think that I'm uh, pretty defenseless and then uh, once they get close to me I'm going to switch to the iron one and then hopefully go and try and take some people out. I also want to get outside this castle. I love the castle uh, but I spent my entire time in here so I want to uh, go back outside and investigate and there's something written here uh, this fire is bootyful. Oh, it is absolutely bootyful. <laughs> oh dear. Right, let's go find some people then. Let's go take some people out. Right, okay. Coast is clear. Look left, look right. It's like crossing the road, isn't it, when you, you go to a, a wide open space. It's where I died down there. There's a little pit of water, and I'm kind of curious to see what's in there, but um, it's how I died last time. It's just like this. Right, I'm going to be very careful this time. No one can see me go in. Right, the chances of me getting killed in one of these places twice in a row is unbelievable, so I'm going to have a look. Uh, there we go. I've got a few more cookies. I don't really need them. I'll leave the, the rest of the cookies there for someone else. That'd be nice. I share my cookies. All right, let's get out of here. I don't like this place. i got bad memories of uh, being in the, the one on the other side. And uh, let's have a go around the outside of the map. What I could do is uh, go up to where I said up the top of that castle and then that way I've got a good chance of uh, looking over the map and seeing uh, where everyone else is. So let me get my, my iron sword ready. Uh, Limardo was slain by Venomous Spyro. There seems to be uh, only a few people left. Venomous Spyro seems to be doing very well uh, as does uh, Ballistic Squid. They seem to be my main competitors. Who have we got left? Then we've got Spyro, Alpha Lee and Ballistic Squid. There's only four of us left so uh, I've managed to do okay just to, to get to this bar. And uh, let's go and try and see where they are then. Uh, I'm going to go around to this side. I've not been around to the uh, the back of the map over on this side yet. I've not had a, a look around here. And oh, look, what's this down here? Oh, a little water elevator. <laughs> oh, dear. Uh, anyway, shall we see if I can go to the top of this this tower? Oh, sh sh can you hear that? There's someone chewing. There's someone in this building here. Right, here we go. Let's go and surprise them. Where are they? Oh, they got dogs. Right, okay, ready? Three, two, one, charge! Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Oh, I've set him on fire, I've set him on fire. There we go. 
I bet that scared the life out of him. <laughs> oh, dude, just completely charged in and destroyed him. I just heard him there chewing. That was his downfall. Oh, God, I hope it doesn't happen to me as well. I'm here chewing now as well. <laughs> All right, let's go get my, my hunger fully up, shall we? No one's coming in. Right, okay, I think there's a, a few potions over here I can pick up. So I got a swiftness there. I think I might have got a, another swiftness as well. And uh, potion of harm. Okay, I don't want that. Oh, look, there's Lily. I'm sorry, Lily. I'm sorry. I didn't mean anything by Lily. Lily, you can have a cookie. You can have a cookie. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to kill him. Well, I did mean to kill him, I'll be honest. But <laughs> I didn't mean to, I don't know. I didn't mean to make you look so upset about it. Anyway, I'm going to put some of his armor on while he watches me. Those used to be his clothes. Oh, God, I'm getting hit. What was that? What's that? Oh, there's someone shooting arrows at me. Who's that? Who's around here? God, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have a, I'm gonna have a swiftness potion now. Then I'm just gonna charge out. I think my only chance is to, to fight them close up because I haven't got a bow. Right, let's just go, 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 go. Where are they? Where are they? Where are they? Is there someone chasing me? Oh, where are they? So someone knows where I am and I don't know where they are and I do not like that. Oh, here's, here's someone right here. This, this, this might be a different person, actually. I got a few good hits. I got a few good hits on them. All right, they're going after me. Oh, they went to get a potion. Oh, they poisoned me, though. All right, I'm going to have to go in. I'm going to have to charge in. I'm going to have to charge in before I get poisoned too much. There we go. Get them. There we go. I managed to get them. Right, I don't know. If, I think there might be someone else nearby, though. Oh, no, the squid! Squid was right behind me! I thought I was getting hurt by the poison, but he killed me! No, if I managed to get away and had all that stuff, I might have won. <laughs> well played, sir. Well played. <laughs> ah, dear ballistic squid got me! I was feeling so confident after that. Oh, what an epic game of Hunger Games these uh, yeah, these last two rounds have been. I take my hat off to ballistic squid. Uh, he uh, is the, uh, the victor of this round. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed this video. There'll be a link in the description to the download of the map, uh, as well as the uh, builders of the map, and uh, everyone else who was playing and recording. Uh, there'll be a link to their channels if you want to go and uh, check out their views uh, to see how much fun they had in this Hunger Games. Uh, but that's the end of this video here. I want to say a very big thank you to all of you for watching and everyone who was playing, and I'll see you all later.